How's it going viewers? Thank you guys for watching this video. In this video I will have a couple tutorials on the Samsung Galaxy S7 in the camera slash photo department. Uh, the first tutorial will be on how to get your phone to automatically save your pictures to an SD card. By default it is set to save to the phone. But if you wanted to make it save to the card, um, when I installed my memory card into the phone, it gave me the option to set it, a little pop-up screen popped up and showed me how to do it, or just showed an option, just click OK and it will automatically set. Um, let's say you have already bypassed that, you hit cancel, you didn't do that. Um, it is fairly easy to set. First thing you're going to want to do is go into your camera. Once you're in camera, you go up to the setting button right up here little wheel and go ahead and select that once you are there scroll down until you see this storage location and you go ahead and select that and now it gives you phone or SD card uh, so one of the two and I'm gonna go ahead and select SD card and now every single time I take a picture it automatically saves it to the SD card so if you wanted to pull it out and transfer the photos or share them with somebody you can go ahead and do it that way so that is how you automatically set your storage location to an SD card and the next tutorial is going to be for if you have already had pictures on your phone and you have gotten a new memory card and you're just going to transfer them so if, you know if the setting wasn't set earlier or if you didn't have the memory card this is how you transfer the pictures from your device from your phone to the SD card so you're going to want to leave the camera settings go into apps from apps go into settings once you are in the settings, go ahead and select storage. Once you're in, in the storage setting, select internal storage. And once you're here, scroll all the way down to the bottom. You will see explore. Go ahead and hit that. And once you're in explore, you might be able to find some of your photos in pictures. Uh, I go to DCIM. And here I have screenshots and camera. Uh, right now my camera is empty, I have nothing there. I do have a couple screenshots, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys with this one. You're gonna wanna select more up here in the top right corner. Once you have that, it gives you a bunch of different options. You're gonna wanna do edit. And from here, you can select random pictures, individual pictures, you're probably gonna have a list of them. Or if you wanna do all of them, there is an all button, so you can check that and it will uh, move all of them. There's a delete button, you don't wanna do that. What you're gonna wanna do is select more again. Here it gives you the option to move or copy. Uh, if you're going to want to, I recommend doing the copy way, just safer. Uh, that way if something doesn't transfer correctly, you haven't deleted it. If you hit move, it will transfer to, straight to the SD card. And sometimes they don't transfer, they don't move over. Uh, so you might lose information. So I always go with copy and then I will check later. So I go to SD and then it's going to ask you what file you want to go into. Uh, you can just pretty much pick. I'm going to go back to DCIM and I'm going to hit camera. It's going to bring up some of the other pictures on the card. I'm going to hit done. And just like that, it transferred them right over. But I was saying earlier, I would uh, do the copy uh, version of it just because sometimes it doesn't transfer over. And I would just go back, pull the, you know, even if you needed to pull the card out and check it with a different source, make sure everything transferred over before deleting it off of your phone. That way you are 100% guaranteed that everything transferred over before you delete it. So just, you know, looking out for you guys. I, I would hate to see you guys lose your information, but I'd say copy is the safe, safest way. And if you want to delete them, even let's say we, we, you did the copy, copied everything in, and once everything is set, I'll just come back out. So if you want to, you copied everything the first time and you want to delete it the second time. So all you're going to want to do is go back to your settings and then from your settings, go back into storage, go back to internal storage, back, back down to explore the same way we came in, go back to DCIM and screenshots. And then that way you can just do more edit, select everything, and then you could just delete it. So it's going to delete these two files. Are you sure? Yes, delete, and just like that, you will have everything that you transferred over. You can just delete it, just like that. So, hope you guys found this video helpful. This is how to transfer pictures from your uh, Galaxy S7 to a SD memory card. If you found this video helpful, go ahead, give me a thumbs up. If you know somebody that might be struggling with this and needs help, go ahead and share this video with them. Let them know. And if you guys like the videos, you guys can go ahead and subscribe just to stay up to date, up to speed with all the other videos that I have. Uh, so you guys can check that out. If you guys need other help on Samsung Galaxy, I have a playlist of tutorials. You can check that out. There's going to be a link in the description below. 
And if you guys have any comments, questions, or concerns, go ahead and drop them in the comment section below. Thank you guys for watching. Have a nice day.